probably like reunite all those meetings into this meeting um, and just address that. I think ACAP is the, the idea there. Um, I don't even actually know who well, was part of that, but I'm not really concerned with it. But I am concerned with the uh, the problems of, uh, I don't know, that could be created from it. So we'll see what we need to add that so. to the agenda. How do people feel about talking about this on, at this meeting? Yes? Okay, so let's add that on there. And then, um, I also, the other item, the only other item I wanted to add was uh, that we think we probably do need to brainstorm for, again, you know, what, what happens when they don't renew the permit, if they don't renew the permit, and um, we need to talk about whether we're, you know, willing to, like, chain ourselves to barrels or like leave peaceably or get trespassing tickets and not pay them or some in between or you know brainstorm brainstorm uh, temperature check do you, have, yeah, so, do you think that might not be a better thing for this um saturday on the one to five thing yeah, there'll be a lot of time no there. no no they're, no, they're not that's, not that's at a all. specific event yeah the, well the thing on saturday is specifically it's it's part of a two it's well i guess i'll just give specific real quick it's part of like a almost two week plan to create a proposal on how to redefine the conception of public space and the idea is to create a legal document that can be spread to all the movements that can be used to fortify our claim to use this space. So on Saturday, the idea is that there's going to be people researching specifically about this issue. And on Saturday, there's an, it's an educational session for people that want to be a part of this. And then after, there's also a period where people can talk about it. So it's not just like a lecture. Um, and it's, but that's, but yeah. Yeah, because right there's some uh, talk in city council about uh, well, Dave Norris kind of brought it up on the seventh about maybe Lee Park could Being be a, a free, free twenty-four hours free speech thing, and that comment I think was yeah, what that all and that's kind of what's brought it out. We have a direct response with so, yeah, Holly. So. Um, um, in terms of talking about what we're going to do when the police come, I think that's an issue that isn't even really something that we can talk about because everybody's making their own individual choices and it's not really a general assembly issue. It's a personal choice issue. How far are you willing to go? So think about it, but I don't think it needs to be All right, well, let's so well, we'll to check on, do you want to talk about what happens, what do we do when the permit runs out? Do you want to talk about that? Yeah, you want to need to talk <laughs> about it. All right, so let's put that on the agenda. All right, next. <laughs> I would, talk me. Um, yeah. I would love some clarification of the working committees. There was like eight or nine, and now they're fluid. I was told the committees are now fluid. So I'm on, <laughs> it's really difficult for people to plug in when you say, who's the action committee? I really want to know those people and understand where they've been and where we're going and have some system of accountability. Like I'm doing the zine, and I'm on outreach committee, and I want to redefine those if we could bring that up somehow, redefine, have a point person, and get people plugged in. <laughs> All right, so talk, then, yeah, do you guys want to talk about that? Yeah? Yeah. All right, that looks good. Then. All right, any... Yeah, yeah um, I'd like to talk about maybe moving, especially our weekend GAs, to a more family-friendly time instead of 6 o'clock when kids need to be having dinner, like 3 in the afternoon. Um, and possibly having less GAs in the week, I think 14 is a lot. And um, like I've come to morning GAs, and when you've got a GA with four people, it's kind of hard to, you know, it's, it's more of a general form, it's not really a GA, because four people is just not enough people to make a decision. So it, can I just, and the agenda setting period is really just to like say, put something in the agenda, and if you wanna talk about it, that's for when we get a, on a stack. So like, I like that you guys want to talk, but it's not the time. Um, so I feel like that's probably something we can add to the agenda. It's starting to get a long agenda, but we, we did decide earlier in time that, you know, we just go about it and we can decide that maybe we're too tired. We can put it, you know, table it for the next time. That's always a possibility uh, when we have long agenda items. Our long agenda. And there's Herb, you want to say. It's an agenda question. There was a police liaison meeting today, and it sort of relates to what I'm Jordan's top that's I'm gonna, covered. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring it up, and you, I would actually, I want to ask you to speak on that. Thank you. All right. Okay. Yes. Awesome. Is there any other things you guys want to talk about? Nine? Awesome.
All right, so let's totally get started with this. Um, what? Like, can you just read what's on the agenda right now so everyone knows? Review discussion regarding outside organizations, our press, police, etc. Um, factions in camp. Uh, what happens if government isn't renewed? Brainstorming. Group clarifications. Weekend GAs at friend. Uh, family from the time slash less GAs. What I missed. That was All right, perfect. That's, yeah. um, so, I guess it seems like the first two on that agenda are pretty pertinent, which is the factions and the, the talking about the police and media. I feel like those are kind of the most important thing on there. How, do you guys, how do you feel about talking about those two first? Anyone doesn't want to talk about this first? Okay, cool. So why don't why don't we start with the the the, the